Hello, welcome back to this Slice and Dice. I'm the Harbinger, and we are currently on a 10 win win streak. And uh, let's go back in it to tie, tie the hard. I'm gonna go basic this time, and uh, let's see what we have here as options. Big hitter, uh, yeah, when you do hard, you need to do a curse, and uh, big hitter is one of the worst curses, I think, just because you are guaranteed losing a guy every time uh, you're being hit, hit by a big, big thing. Bot blank isn't really it it, it uh, makes all your heroes worse but uh, it doesn't make your enemies better so that's um, so that's something to consider shield response is annoying because uh, every time you hit an uh, enemy they basically heal for one uh, so you need to do a lot more damage especially in the early game when you have uh, like one and two uh one and two pips there the, it's it just makes enemies a lot more um, a lot more durable Add carrier uh, the last 10, uh, 10 levels of the game. I, uh, I, I don't like this. I think, I think we're gonna go for a boring one, bot blank, and uh, take it from here. Try to uh, defeat every enemies with uh, a lot of my guys without, uh, without their bottom powers. Uh, yeah, we can... Uh, Something like this. I don't know why I picked this death protection thing. We don't need it <laughs> this turn. Um, maybe Clumsy needs it now because they can die first thing here if they are unlucky. So let's just take that and uh, make, sure, yeah, make sure we don't die. And then we can do this. And uh, then the first round is over. Okay. So we can either go for Sparkly or Knight. Knight is really low, uh, low value here, and I really like Sparkly, so um, this is a good deal for us here. Let's see, uh, we don't need this shield here, so let's try to rebuild into something better. Of course you don't get that. Um, sure, one mana is one of the... Most more sensible things we can get out of Acolyte this turn. Uh, yeah, this wasn't that good. Um, so I guess we can uh, stop the Goblin from uh, doing too much damage by stunning him. And let's uh, just protect the Acolyte and uh, take it from there. This Cold Crypt thing uh, damages us because it's clumsy and uh, they just do that. So I'm gonna try to not not have them die on us but uh sure stop <laughs> stop acting let's see we can also uh, we can use sap here if we just get somebody down to two um can we can we win this round without uh this this turn here i think we might we might be able to if we do this this and here we can sap the boar, then we can burst the rat, and the turn is over. Yeah, okay. Choose a thing. Wolf Ares uh, is uh, oh, it's half okay early on, but um, uh, seedling is seedling is actually a good item here. It 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 could be used to replace bad uh, bad early game thing. For example, I. I don't think, I don't think this one is that useful early. Uh, take five damage pain. I think I think I take this. It's gonna be really okay against um, if we encounter that uh, three stub thing. That's uh, hard for us to do it. So yeah, because this deals five damage, but we also take five damage. So if we are already being targeted, it's uh, really hard to um, to also survive here. So we can't take that. Uh, Oh, this is bad. Okay, we are dying anyway, so we might as well go down swinging. We, or, or I guess we can uh, we can burst to save. So in that case, we should. Let's see. Uh, can we sap the boar? We can, but we can sap the wolf. So let's sap the wolf, burst to save Raphael, and. Uh, and turn without spending that pain thing. Uh, that's the best die he can have. 
and that is okay i think we are going to zap the boar and we're going to kill the archer reroll acolyte with our generated hero yeah sure that's the r18 ace they have um, a vampire attack and uh, heal one vitality mana add engage to target sites and mend uh, we are against troll. Against troll, I think trapper is. Yeah, it's not that good. But clumsy is horrible. So let's just replace uh, replace clumsy and take troll here. Uh, take trapper here. And if we uh, if we get uh, if we get weakness, we will be really happy. We didn't, but we can do some damage here and uh, go next turn. Trolls heal, but uh, they don't heal that much, so um, we we aren't that scared. That, there is the weakness, so we can now do a lot of damage if we just get more damaging inputs here. Um, we didn't, but let's see what we can do here. Uh, there is that, so we can do... We can almost, almost kill here, but we need to um, spend mana here to protect ourselves. We should probably be able to finish them off now. Four damage here means that we are one, two, three, four. We need one more so we can kill before we can kill them with with sap. Or we could, um, or we could uh, burst pain. Oh yeah, we have, we we have it. We have it. Uh, derp. Uh, we burst to so save Raphael, then we pain, and then we kill with the growth. Hmm. Swap Wallow with the uh, R1 Ace. Sure. Um, Golden Fred, yellow heroes only add plus one pip to non damage sides or add ranged to the left side. Hmm. I don't think uh, yellow heroes will have that much uh, non-damage things, but yeah, I mean adding ranged is okay. So, uh, we can take out some uh, some cool stuff with it. So let's add range to that. <laughs> That's good. This is a stun on something, which is great. We don't need. Uh don't need dodge here and okay who do we want to kill uh, this insta kills anything below four which means we can kill this mm. goblin and we can stun the snake and get some uh, get some manas kill another thing and uh, that's just uh, that's just around because the goblin, last goblin will run away when they are alone on the battlefield that's it collector Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, um, I don't like Pilgrim, so um, let's go Collector here. And uh, yeah, they can just have these items. Dun -dun. Two damage, good damage things. Weakness, weakness is great. And another damage damage thing here. Okay, we can definitely kill the quartz this turn. And I think that's what we're going to prioritize to do. So let's see. We should do it like like this, I think. And um can we just start having chingle snake? It's a shame to waste um to waste uh to waste the weakness like that, but it is what it is. Oh, that snake's dead. That means this snake is also dead. Okay, Abacus, shift my row across by one. Hmm. Golden cup! <laughs> I'll infinite max, uh, or 100 max uh, HP and mana. This one is a little bit annoying because it really ruins your, um, it ruins your, um, your uh, graphic like this. But uh, having a lot of mana is cool, so uh, let's take that. So he's taking seven damage, so he is currently dying. 
Uh, if we can uh, get enough shields on them, then they will... Then uh, the militia will run away, but we don't really have targeted shields. So uh, I think we just have to kill... Either I <coughs> either kill the militia or uh, stun the cyclops. Cyclops will be stunned if we get down to um, this uh, third... Uh, this uh, midway HP here. Yeah, we didn't get that, but we can at least kill the militia here. I think we have enough damage. And uh, then we should be able to stun the Cyclops next turn, which means we should be able to um, should be able to kill it the turn after that. Uh, if we are not very unlucky here, though. Mm -mm, we need to do four damage, then we can zap it. Um, okay, that's bad dice. Bad dice. Okay, race is dead here, and uh, we were almost, uh, almost uh, entirely dead here if we can't deal with it. But at least this, this one will duplicate, so uh, we can get every other dice to become that, and then we can uh, zap them. Okay, uh, Arbon Eight C. Are you okay, or do we want to replace you with a vampire? I think we want to replace you with a vampire. Having the extra healing is nice. Yeah, this one this one ain't that good. Yeah, let's let's go for a vampire. Even though targeted uh, target target targeted defense would would be really nice against the fanatic. Um. Yeah, there's, there's nothing to stun for us here. Okay, so uh, we are damaging the Fnatic as much as we can now, because uh, he needs to die before he does like 8 damage on us. Uh, or we can stun him, I guess. Imp, Imp does a lot of damage too. Wait, wait what's, how much damage, the damage is this? 8 damage and death? Okay, you can uh, just dodge that. And uh, mm, mm, mm. Uh, reroll that. Okay, so we will stun the fanatic, torch the imp, and we will damage the bell, I guess. We can kill him next turn. Uh, imp does just regular damage. Uh, yeah, there is a kill, kill attack. This can kill the imp or the fanatic or anything. Okay, we are we are very much in uh, in control in this uh, battle now. And the bell will kill itself next turn after summoning another imp. Let's dodge that, and I uh, guess uh, if we first dodge, then attack the bell, we will win this round here. Okay. Power stone, gray heroes only. Replace the middle side with uh, zero mana steel. Mm, that, that could be a one nice way to generate a lot of mana. But we don't have any, any way to get defense onto him without that, so maybe not. All heroes plus one item slot, max four. Uh, but they get two less item slots. Yeah, sure, we can do some cool. Uh, we can do some cool. Um, some cool, cool. Uh, cool combinations with that because now we can have three items on everybody. Um, let's put it on vampires since they can self-heal. Let's see, ghost needs to die fast because they damage a lot. I mean, but we need also need to kill them over two turns because of how that thing works, so yeah, I guess this is uh, I guess Wallop is just going to die here. Because I didn't respect the ghost here. Ow! Uh, let's do this and that. And then we attack the imp. Wallop dies, sadly. Then we need to kill the ghost and then we need to kill the whiz. Uh, yeah. Dun, dun, dun. Well, 
we say it, uh, we say, we say it's, it's not gonna be a problem because we can again stun him. Like uh, we can do the ogres and stuff. So he's stunned, and we can go next turn, and then he even runs away. Okay. Um, we can upgrade uh, wallop into bard or into cleric. Let's see, cleric uh, has uh, both of these has uh, uh, so bard has a tactic while um, cleric has a spell. Um, both of them do cleanse and are single casts, but. I think I prefer else here, just because we have these guaranteed blanks, and uh, Bard can spend these blanks to do uh, else, which is a really good, uh, really good thing here. I'm going to put, I'm going to put uh, Fletching on the Bard so he can hit uh, range stuff with uh, with the throne knife, and I'm going to put uh, the seedling on the collector because. The growth there is better than the uh, the fish, usually. Um, okay, let me roll again. That's a great die. And defense is good. Um, let's see, heal the bard because he has less HP than the vampire. Now, how do you want to do this? Do we want to dwindle down the bones? Maybe I think I think that's nice. Dwindle down the bones. So damage there. Do that and kill. Uh, mm. Maybe we don't need to do it this way. We can um, kill that bone. Leave more damage done out it over there. Okay, this is an okay one. Um, zombie here uh, is gonna do a lot of damage to us. Uh, ooh, this kills some bones. It even kills the zombie if we uh, do this to it. And I think that's actually a priority over killing the bones because he is gonna wreck our collector if we don't do anything about them. So there and uh follow up and there and that and then we else the trapper to save them Ooh, collector is also going to die though we need some heals or something we can heal with infuse Slimer, bones are attacking Bard, but Slimer is also attacking everybody. Um, yeah, Slimer needs to die. There, let's else that. And now it's just, uh, now it's just heal up. No, 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 no. There we go. Okay, polished emerald is cool. Um, gain effect of uh, all tier one, two, two, four items on other people, uh, except that. Um, how would that work? Would the other people have? But that means that we have two cards, and people can have four items. I need to test this. Yeah, people can have four items now. Ooh, that's so cool, and it's just not going to happen. But uh, yeah, okay, that's uh, that's a cool mechanic. I mean, also I means Sparky can have uh, stuff again. Um, yeah, but I think you still going to have the cap on the vampire until now. All right. That gives a sniper. This does damage to the spiker. Uh, yeah, he's gone. Ouch! Ouch! 
And uh, yeah, we also have infinite infinite um, mana to save up. Let's see. And stats. Growth. Oh, and having ranged on that uh, counter thing also means that we don't take uh, self damage every time we do that. That's that's a neat uh, that's a neat uh, twist to it. Okay, okay. A dual loop. Add mana gain to all sides with exactly one pip. Um, I guess we would have a lot of counter mana gains, but. An extra call and a sniper in a boss fight feels uh, feels a little bit scary, so I'm gonna pass on that. Berion, awesome guy. If you have any items to make these go away, <laughs> uh, we don't. So I think we are going with the doctor here. He has uh, poison and uh, liquor and stuff, so. It's not my favorite, but uh, I guess I guess uh, I prefer them over over the uh, self uh, self killing uh, barbarian. Okay, let's see. We are killing that bones and that bones. And I guess uh, let's just cleanse because I'm killing that bones. We just have to dwindle him down uh, a little by little. So yeah, uh, the petrification uh, ain't that bad because we have access to liquor. So um, yeah, let's just build up stuff here. Ah. Oh, did we get petrified already? Let's see. Uh, heal yourself for now. And let's kill that bones. Uh, oh, yeah, we can also else. Uh, yeah, we can also use... Um, we can also use uh, the excess and the petrified excess to else out. Because a bard is really good as a hero. Uh, or at least the ability. Um, I don't like uh, poisoning ourselves here. So let's not. Even though we have access to region, so yeah, um, sweet there, and then we are just accepting that we are spawning a bones here, but we can do this and remove that bones, and then we are back here, and then we get another bones. Okay. We are currently weakened. We can redeem that with else if needed. to redeem it with liquor. I guess that's worth it. Oh yeah, we spent that guy's thing. I will. We also removed some petrification there. Um, mm, 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 mm. Uh, that kills the bones, that kills the other bones. This does damage to the lich. No, let's spend that. And we almost have them here. We do have them. We do have them. Nice. Okay. Oh, blindfold. Oh, we could have taken the uh, barbarian. Let Let's take the blindfold just in case. Just in case we get it, because uh, it removes all all keywords, and uh, that makes um, that makes them really good. Double cyclops. Um, yeah, we need to, we need to do single target damage. I guess this kind of is single target damage. And let's protect the dark. Okay. 
guess this is kind of worth. Um, yeah, we need to also do damage to this guy. And let's stun this guy. No. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay, so we need to kill this guy next turn. And then we need to stun this guy next turn. I think we are okay. I think we are okay. Yeah, okay, he's already stunned. Then we just need to do four damage to this guy. And uh, here that damage is. Uh, let's see, there. There. Uh, sure. And he should run away. Ooh, Captain! I haven't seen this guy before. He has uh, three damage focus, cleave chain, defense, and cleave chain. Yeah, we need um, we need something to make uh, this, these chains proc for them to be for them to be good. I think. But uh, Venom is always always really good. So um, I'm gonna go with her or him. Is Venom her or him? I don't really know. Um, let's see. Chomp is a bit scary. Caw is a bit scarier. Here's some healing and uh, here is some protection. Can we kill something here? I don't think we can. We have access to uh, two, four, six, eight damage. That's not enough to kill something here. Uh, secondary, we can do a lot of damage to the core, but not enough. We we can't save the bard here. They just have to die. I think. I don't think we can save the bard. Can we save the bard? I don't think we can do. So we just have to uh, have to uh, live with what happens there. Also, if we damage the chomp, I th think we get away with it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, let's pre-start uh, the region and Sparky so they can get some health back there. Okay. We need to deal with the car and maybe the chomp. This poison stuff here is really scary. Let's see. Yeah, you live, but only technically and only for a little bit here. Let's see. Um, no, no, no. Uh, Venom has enough health to, to tank. Tank the damage from Chomp here. Sparky don't. Uh, can we kill the Ogre this turn? I think we can kill the Ogre this turn. No, we need to... Uh, do this first and we can spend liquor to heal that's uh, that's possible one two three four that doesn't help us um, deal with the chomp Hmm. We do that. We don't do that. We deal with Chomp instead, I think. We heal Sparky. Then we deal with Chomp. That's not good enough. Why does this only give one? That doesn't help either. What? Hmm. Ch -ch -ch -ch. 
Okay, I think you just accept that. Um, that Sparky dies too. Because we can't, we can't. I don't, I don't think we can keep him, keep him alive here. Uh, yeah, of course that doesn't help. <laughs> Just keep the uh, keep the man around so we can uh, use it to deal with the ogre. Okay. Uh, yeah, this should uh, work pretty nice. Okay, uh, boots of speed, additional reroll and dodge, or pair of kings. Pair of kings. Let's us uh, get a lot more poison, a lot more region. Hmm. Let's see what we're we up against. We're up against basilisks and trolls. I think I want. Uh, I think I want more poison here. Uh, so yeah, there. Uh, already is uh, yeah protect yourself uh, let's see we damage the gnoll and we can uh, four poison the basilisk uh, heal ourselves zap the gnoll attack the troll Basilisk dies this turn. Uh, we don't need to care about that. And uh, yeah, we can maybe do a lot of damage to the troll here. We can't. Or if we if we liquor this up, then we can. Ah, nice. Um, sure. And the troll is dead. Change of heart. Heal for a thousand. Unlocks an item. Change of heart. Okay. Um, Archer Slate. Troll King. Uh, sure, that's. Um, Man of Death. I don't like that. I, I don't like the ghast. Yeah. Uh, let's take the brawler here. And um, still take that seedling. We could take the seedling instead of uh, instead of that um, plague thing. Uh, yeah. Uh, to poison is nice. We can kill the archer. We don't really need to kill the archer, though. It's much better to uh, get uh, extra damage onto um, onto the slate. And let's else up, else up venom. Slate is almost dead. Dun, dun, dun. Archer is dead. Then it's um, we need to make sure um, make sure Venom is alive. Okay, yeah, we can we can else the, the remaining um, remains of there. So okay, so kill Slate, kill the Archer, heal Venom, else, else. Okay, then it's the Troll King's turn. Uh, that helps, this helps. This helps a lot. Uh, yeah, just attack with what you have here. Heal yourself. Um, heal Brawler. Licker. Actually, liquor is really good when we have these uh, additional uh, additional health items because it just heals overheals a lot. Mm 
Uh, uh, uh. Okay, yeah, these are good ties. Uh, sure, heal the board. somewhat gonna be a uh, attritional uh, battle almost but uh, yeah okay there he is dead okay uh golden cup seedling and fletching for random level four item so yeah i i, I don't think we're going to need fletching i don't think we're gonna need seedling gold cup is fun but we, we, we would gain another item that we can use twice because of um, because of uh, polished emeralds. So I think it's worth it. Uh, yeah, that's not uh, that's not that worth. But sure, we we did it. Okay. Uh, serration or Tom Rimbariba add error to all mana gain sides. That's a really good item. Oh, that would have been so good if we still had that goblet of 100 extra mana thing. Mm. Well, 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 well. Uh, it's actually gonna be really good for uh, for this attack here, but we, we aren't keeping Sparky around for the end game, so maybe not. Add vulnerable to top and bottom. That means top. Uh, yeah, we don't really care about adding vulnerable to any of these, so let's take the Tourmaline Pariba and uh, put it here. Yeah, I think it's going to be best on Sparky. This isn't that good. Bard is going to die. Uh, unless we can do something uh, really cool here. Uh, oh yeah, we can we, we can kill a zombie here. Uh, that doesn't help, but we can. Um, let's kill. Let's kill that zombie. And we need to do damage to these shades. Yeah, we can't. Uh, I we can we can prevent three damage, but not four. So yeah, we just have to start damaging these shades. I think. Shame. Uh, yeah, this kills the shades. So let's do that and there, plant that, heal her, give us some mana and uh, yeah, ooh yeah, let's uh, lose out of some mana. We can um, we can mark and uh, destroy the zombie next turn. Even do four damage here. Okay, okay, that's actually a uh, clean win here. So uh, let's do that. Okay. Varlock or Stoic? I don't like uh, I don't like uh, getting error to pain sides. That just seems like a recipe for disaster. And then we just have one one uh, mana side uh, one mana gain side left. So I think we upgrade Bard to Stoic here. Yeah, and uh, yeah, you can keep this one. We don't have anybody to give the blindfold to, though. Shame. Let's see. Um, is this ranged? It's not ranged. We could use it to deal. Uh, we could do um, plague to do a lot of uh, a lot of damage to basilisk. Actually, 
Plague, uh, Plague Doctor and Venom is a really good combo. Holy. Let's see. We do this. Then this does how much damage? Nine. That just outright, outright kills the Chomp. Uh, and the Basilisk. So he's gonna die again, but um, we uh, we live through that. Uh, now we are gonna need some healing. Um, oof. Okay. Uh, so this uh, is uh, damage to the uh, bottommost enemy. That's uh, Sparky. And uh, we also need to liquor up Venom. And uh, let's kill this guy. And let's not... Let's not damage the shop because then Sparky will die. And then we can just zap him this turn instead. Okay, Eye of War is a really good item. Adds a pip to all our interesting sides. Overflowing Callus adds Fizz to the three right sides. Uh, plus one pip for each ability used this turn. Hmm. We don't really have anything to, to use that on, so let's just take the Eye of Horus and give that to... Give that to Brawler. Okay. Should we try to do the play combo again? Mm -mm -mm. Oh... Two demons are really, uh, really tough to deal with. Um, Stoic can can protect themselves this turn, I think. That's cool. Ah. Uh, okay. Um, sure. Let's poison everything. Ah, we 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 don't have uh, we don't have a uh, bard any longer, so we can't we can't spend those. Uh, Let's just start killing one of the demons. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, these uh, brain tumors thing are so uh, so annoying to deal with. We might need to sacrifice Stoic here. Let's see, we can do this so that we can uh, heal these guys without taking self damage and getting ruined that way. Then we can almost kill the demon. One demon down. He's gonna summon imps. That's not that scary. Uh, we need to save the duck somehow. Healing there is somewhat gonna do it. Um, start there. Do that damage. And first self. Uh, okay, that's uh, that's really strong for us. Uh, we do need to kill the demon. I think we have that in control. Poison damage on the spiker is awesome. Um, let's see. Yeah, we do this. No, we, yeah, we can't do that. We can't do it that way. Uh, we need to first first heal, then burst. Then do that. Okay. Then we can 
This is eight damage. We need to kill that imp. Um, mm -mm. Oh, uh, and we also need to do the ranged attack on this spiker after we do the heal. So let's reset, do the ranged attack. Then we burst, then we attack, then we kill this imp. Then we... Hmm, then we liquid doctor instead. Yeah, this is fine. This is fine. Totally fine. Uh, here... Yeah, that, that's a pseudo heal. Since it's so much mana. Uh, take down that imp. Heal, cleanse, and uh, yeah. Yeah, uh, he's dead. Okay, final fight. It's, it's the dragon. Okay. I think wizard is I think wizard is the key here. We get uh, era on all of these things. Era on perma boost is going to be really cool if we survive long enough for it to uh oh it's not a man again so we, are, we we don't get we don't get um it on that but uh, it's fine. Uh let's see. We can rename them? Okay. That's cool. Um, let's uh, learn Mark. And uh, do anybody need Blindfold? I don't think so. But I think uh, Wizard is going to have a nice time. So this is going to give us so much mana uh, over the course of the game. But uh, yeah, let's see. We can kill the Kaw this turn. Is that a priority? We can kill the archer. Let's start to kill the archer. Let's kill the archer. Damage the core. Regen the stoic. Self defend the stoic. And just gain as much mana as we can. What do we use the perma boost on? Mm, I think. I think we burn a boost to uh, perma boost to wizard, just because we want to gain as much mana as uh, humanly possible fast. Okay. This is gonna be a lot of mana. That kills the core. Uh, yeah, this kills the core. Mm -mm -mm. And uh, yeah, we uh, liquor up stoic to defend. Uh, we damage the dragon while it's poison four. And uh, yeah, we could have we could mark them. Maybe we should have spent that mana to uh, to cleanse instead. Oh, come on, give us mana. Okay, that's at least some mana. Um, there, another there. Maybe it's not that critical anyway. Yeah, we can. We we already do on this, right? Boom. Okay, we had some nice combos in here. And uh, yeah, some neat uh, item interaction. Uh, theoretically, we could have had four items equipped on uh, one of the heroes, but we, we just had six usable items the entire game, so that's not uh, that bad. And uh, we are now up at 2:05. We are not that far away from um, not that far away from top 200. And uh, yeah, hopefully our winning streak will. Uh, get uh, far and wide in this uh, in this game thank you guys for watching it's been harbinger and i'm signing out